want to know what it is. It is the world that has been pulled over your eyes to blind you from the truth. Okay, so we got in a taxi, got to this this eye here, and I am kind of happy that it's under maintenance because I don't do heights, and I was kind of crapping myself to go up on this. However, I have been on it before, so I will share a little bit of that video with you just now to prove that even though I am scared of the old heights, I did go on this changing eye which I thoroughly recommend and I believe it's much better in the evening so the next time I come back to Tianjin I will go on this in the evening promise hope to die no I don't hope to die I'm just going to go on this <laughs> anyway whoo hey whoo not on the London eye or oh, the Tianjin eye <laughs> So we're right next to this um, temple here, which we believe is a temple. So we may go in and have a look if we can get in. But a lot of things are actually closed at this moment in time for various reasons. I think maybe it's Monday morning and typically it's not that busy. But by the looks of it, we might be able to get in. And if not, we're going to go and see something else pretty cool. So we came inside the temple, it's actually a Buddhist temple, it's a really serene, beautiful, quiet place. On a beautiful day, I have to say, this is quite a peaceful moment, so I don't want to disturb too many people, but it is very, very serene, calm, quiet, peaceful, everything that you could expect from a, I would say, a, a Buddhist temple or a monastery, I think it's actually a Buddhist temple and a monastery, so very beautiful.
think this is more of the modern version. keeps going on and on. What a cool area. Really pretty. Really cool. Excellent. And my battery is just about to go. So my closing words are, this is just stunning. Beautiful. Taking a quick look in the wider parts or the other parts of the monastery. And as we see, I don't want to go too close to people who are praying, but it is a very beautiful area. Such a really cool place to, to visit. Um, as you can see in the background right here, a really quiet, peaceful monastery. Uh, it's a Buddhist temple and a monastery. So a very, very quiet, serene area. Um, really contemplative at this moment in time, as always, when I, when I come to a beautiful place like this. It was quite surreal, actually, because we were just on the main street. And then we came away from where the Tianjin Eye was, crossed the road and saw this old building and we, I thought it was a hutong, we actually went in, it was a temple and it's really quite serene. <laughs> Ok, 
mockingbirds. They're burning the sand and burning the the papers for the Buddha. Can you buy that? So colorful. It's a little bit of a little bit of a Oh, so they buy these so for the... these are the things you can buy. Oh. 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 It just says that you can give you write your stamp on it. And you can... Oh. 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 See you again. Thank you for tuning in to my channel. I would ask you to follow me. Subscribe using the button below. But in the meantime, peace out guys. Look after each other. Peace.